Hey guys, I'm here to show you my PC and Nintendo DS game and DVD collection as of today, March the, March the 23rd, 2015. First off, I want to say I bought both the PC and Nintendo DS games from Amazon and both the DVDs for $25. So, here's the, here's the first game I bought, which came with my Amazon package. This is Namco Museum DS with remastered games for the Nintendo DS, which include Pac-Man, Galaga, Dig Dug 2, Xevious, The Towering Bridge, Mappy, Galaxian, and Pac-Man Versus, developed by, by Namco, for, developed by Bandai Namco, formerly Namco Games. As you can see here, there's Pac-Man, there's Dig Dug, there's, there's a lot of games, which I recently got into. I've been playing older games lately, so the next two games are others, are other games. The next two PC games you're gonna see are both from the 90s. Ready to see the, these 90s games? So here's the first one. Here it is, Madeline Rainy Day Activities, which I originally had ever since I was, ever since I was like around six years old. I originally had a disc for this, but then my, but then it sadly broke and I, and once I realized how fun it is with ha having Madeline around, I decided to rebuy it through, rebuy it through Amazon. And as you can see, and as you can see, it's cre and as you know, this game is developed by Creative Wonders, who also created Ses the Sesame Street games and Schoolhouse of Rock. So here is the, as you can see, it's the Windows XP compatible, and it could work with my with my older computer, the the one from 2008 at my grandma's. However, my however my laptop has a Blu-ray optical drive, so it's probably not capable of playing old of playing uh, discs like this. So here's the disc itself, and here's here's what here's the introduction which you can do. And I learn a few I learn a few French words from this. Now moving on to my, to one of my all-time favorite PC games when I was a child. When I was a child, I played this when I was around, f when I was around five to, when I was around five, around three to five, or if I remember correctly, which was released in 1998. Reader Rabbit Preschool Personalized Deluxe, created by the Learning Company. In fact, I like, I like that they used a carnival as a concept. In fact, I like the the part where they used a carnival as a concept, and the and the fact that you that you needed to get tickets for of increasing difficulty. The only problem I did I had with this game is that the is that the is that the level four sections, aka the final the final level sections, were a bit were were very casualized, and they didn't add much challenge for the player. I also like the mini games, and one of my all-time favorite mini games was the was the hide and seek art gallery and crazy costumes. I was told that this couldn't this couldn't run on Windows sixty-four uh, bit operating systems, so you could see so for a playthrough of of this Madeline Rainy Day activities and personalized preschool, I'm gonna use a virtual machine to play Reader Rabbit personalized preschool. And I'll be and I'll be playing a uh, Madeline Rainy Day activities when I go to my grandma's house one day. All right, now on to my D. All right, now on to my DVD, on to my DVD, on to my DVD collection. Now I got these from twenty five doll. Got these DVDs for twenty five dollars as part of the, uh, as part of the DVD store sale. Both movies are from, s both movies. Both movies are directed by Steven Spielberg, and they were both released from 2001 to 2002. Ready? Here you are. The science fiction film Artificial Intelligence and the, and the biographical film Catch Me If You Can. So, so as you probably know, this film's, so as, pro, as you probably know, Catch Me If You Can, Stars one of my favorite, stars one of my favorite actors, Tom Hanks and Leonardo DiCaprio, who I, 
and I and the first time I saw Leonardo DiCaprio was back when I was in Titanic when I was when I was a lot younger so here so here's the disc itself so here's the disc itself by DreamWorks Home Entertainment who also who are also the owners of Anchorman the Legend of Ron Burgundy and and the and the Peacemaker now on to your artificial intelligence this is one of the few underrated films by Steven Spielberg by Steven Spielberg and I and I think I watched this a long time ago ever since I was around 10 or something so here's the disc itself and I'm one and I'm and I'm hoping Steven Spielberg will direct another will direct another film soon so just so just think just fingers crossed have hopes that he will direct another film. Anyway, guys, just want to say this is my DVD collection as of. I just want to say this is my DVD and Nintendo DS and PC game collection as of today, March the 23rd. Thanks for watching.